What is up, tech family? This is Josh High Tech, and on this episode, I'm going to talk about my top five Visual Studio Code themes. To start things off, I'm going to talk about how to install a theme. So the first thing that you need to do is come over here, and then you see these um, sidebars. What you're going to click on are the ones that says that says extension. So you click on that, and then on here you're going to see these extensions. And so what you can do is type in you can mainly just type in themes if you want and then it can give you a, va a vast amount of themes that give you a good idea of what theme that you may like when you're scrolling through like you can see these and they give multiple examples of the different type of themes you can use and it makes it really easy so for example if i wanted to use this theme right here the best way to do that is to go up here and you click install then once you click install it's going to install for you and another thing i always just say is just click reload and that reload your page and then all you do is when you're trying to find it you go to your code right up here you go to preferences and then you go to color theme and then you see it's a shortcut for it it's command k and command t this is for if you have a macbook um and so when you click on it bam and then it will show you your themes right here so i installed a good amount and i just installed the one that was uh this one right here the vo a vow and so this if you click on it then bam here you go i have it to my disposal and then like i say you put command k and command t like after each other so just put command k and then command t and then it should pop up and then it gives me a vast range of different themes that I can just go through. So you see the difference and they're all um, different styles. All right. So that's pretty much how you can access these themes. It's really simple. You know, like I said before, you go to your code and you go to preferences and you go to color theme. And that's usually the way that you can always do it. And if you want to install, remember, you go to your extensions and that's the way that you can find it. And so now I want to get into my top five visual uh, studio code themes. And my first one um, is the one that is duo tone. So duo tone, I type that in and then you will see right here. I absolutely love duo tone and the main one that I use and you see, I have different types over here. The main one that I like is the first one. And my top group is this one. They don't show it on here. Oh, right here. So the Dark Sea. So this one is my absolute favorite one. And I'm just gonna show you all what it looks like on the actual screen. And then it's right here. I have it right here and click it. I love this theme. This theme is very smooth uh, for me. I like the colors of it and it just gets the job done so even in the css is all pretty much consistent um that is something that works for me because i know some people like it where the colors are different when it comes to like styling and things like that but this is just one that i like a whole lot and i don't have them in a particular order per se but this is one of my top fives is the duo dark c and then the next one that i want to talk about is again a duo tone and it is the duo tone dark space. So this is a dual tone dark space. And this one is a little different, but I like it. I like the orange. I like the purple. It gives me a nice uh, feel outside of what's the norm. And sometimes I need to spice things up. If I'm getting tired of just looking at the blue theme, I can switch it up and give me a nice little smooth purple theme. And, that, and this theme will allow me to just see something different and that's mainly what these themes are just to give you a different variety of customization which is why i love um coding so much and it's so good because you can customize your actual code and see exactly how it looks to fit your eye and so that's my second one so now the third theme out of my top five for vs code themes is this one right here command five command t and it is called the monokai uh, dimmed this one is so smooth to me it gives me enough colors i love how it looks in css how it gives me the red 
Some people say red, like you think of it as wrong, but I like this. It really looks nice to me. And so on here, over here, it has a various amount of colors. It has a yellow, blue, and green. And it's just very smooth. Like I said, it has this dark, kind of like black and gray background. And then it has this, these colors. And then it mixes it up. You see the purple up here too when you import. So it just gives me a nice theme. I really enjoy it. And now my fourth one is, I don't know. I think a lot of people use this one, but it is what it is. But I really enjoy it. And this one is the Winter is Coming Dark black one so the winter is coming so winter is coming is very popular uh from what i remember yeah this one is it has over 3.5 million downloads it's crazy um i really like the one like i mentioned before the dark theme or the dark black winter is coming this one has been the one i use the most since i've been a developer it just get the job done for me and i like how it does with css as well it has a different colors to like stand out to me and i've just been using this one the most and yeah, it just gets the job done man it's very clean very smooth the colors are a little bit nicer and they're not as like like so strong colors these are light colors that can still show me exactly what i'm writing so this is my fourth one and then my fifth one this one is the one that has become my new favorite. And this one is the 1MM One Dark Pro. And this one is a new one that I found, but I really, really like it. Um, it's really smooth. And I like how it has the um, italicized on it. And it's just very smooth with the colors. And it just gives a nice touch to the way that it looks. And also the 1MM I'm gonna pull it up on here. So it only has 17,000 installs so far. So it's pretty like fresh and new, but it is very clean. Do you not see this? Look at this. It's very clean. I really enjoy it. Um, this is a Dracula one. This one is the Minokai one. And I hope I'm pronouncing that right, but y'all know what I'm trying to say. And then this one is the One Dark Pro. This is the one I like the most it gets the job done and i really really like it it's become my favorite one so far that's why i saved it for last because the one mm themes this one is cool so yeah that is pretty much it for this video i hope you all enjoyed it just some really good tips on how to install themes and how to access it as well as my top five vs code themes and if you have your favorite code themes for visual studio code be sure to put it in the comments below and let me know because i might i might be sleeping on some new ones i might not know which ones that i really need to be using to customize my my code so please uh put that in the comment section below thank you all for watching espero que tengas un día ciao